This USB-C hub might just be the perfect mix of functionality and size, whether it's for your Mac, Windows laptop or Chromebook. So Tobin One had seen some of my Chromebook reviews, including where I'll test display out options, and they got in touch to ask if I'd like to test out one of their hubs. They've kindly sent me this, it's their dual and triple display 13-in-1 USB-C hub, and I've been testing it for the last couple of months. Check the video description and pinned comment here for a link to their website as well as my Amazon affiliate link if you want to check it out. The unboxing experience is probably just what you'd expect, and whilst it is a bit bigger than previous hubs I've used, the difference is those offered far less connectivity. For example, typically they had just one HDMI port, whereas this has two plus a display port and even more connectivity I'll show you shortly. It's still very much travel sized and it is lightweight at just 153 grams. That's about 0.34 pounds. It's also got a good build quality, solid feel to it with the aluminium outer body and the plastic on either of the shorter ends. This hub packs almost as much connectivity as I use in my dock at my desk. So I imagine for a lot of people, this could be all they need for home and travel. Here on Tobin One's website, you can see the full detailed spec of what this hub is capable of. It's worth being clear that I've been testing with Chromebooks as well as laptops running Windows 10, both with up to two full HD monitors via a mix of HDMI and DisplayPort connectivity. You can see you're more limited if you use a Mac as to the options for the extended displays as this example shows. To show you the full port layout and connectivity now, on one short end of the hub, you've got the USB-C connection to connect into your device, and next to that, that, you've got a three and a half mil audio jack for your audio and then on one of the long sides of the hub you've got two hdmi ports one full size usb 3 port and then the power delivery 3 port for you to plug in your device's power and that can be up to 100 watt pass through based on your charger and your device's requirements on the opposite long side you've got two more full size usb 3 ports so that's three of those in total plus two more full size usb ports but these are usb 2 so that's five full-size USB ports in total and you've got a TF card reader slot as well as a micro SD card reader slot. That's not all though on the other short end you've got a display port connection and next to that you've got a gigabit ethernet port. You can see it here connected up to the Lenovo IdeaPad 3i 15.6 inch Chromebook that I tested recently. The hub's pretty much fully loaded here apart from the memory card slots. I'll link to that review in this video's description. I've used it with at least five other Chromebooks now and two Windows laptops, all have worked flawlessly. The hub can get a little bit warm, but that's to be expected. Just recently, I've had some odd desk setups with a mix of HDMI and DisplayPort monitors, and this really saved the day. If I was being picky, I'd say it'd be nice to see an additional USB-C connection, but for me, that's certainly not a deal breaker. For most people, I think this delivers all the connectivity they'll need, but let me know in the comments what you think, and in the meantime, you may like to check out this next video from the channel.